Hello everyone. To make your video story more attractive, you may need some special video effects such as a green screen or a split screen effect. With Filmora Video Editor, you can easily apply these two effects to your videos. So let's first install the video editor on our computer and load up a new project inside of Filmora. Part 1. How to use a green screen. The first thing we want to do in this process is import our footage for the background and the footage for our green screen. So we can click on the Import Media Files Here folder and select our pieces of footage to import them. Then we'll bring in our footage and match the media into our timeline. And then we'll want to take our green screen footage and drag it as an overlay on top of our background footage. 2. Now we can right click on our overlay and select Green Screen. You'll see this will initially apply a green screen effect, but now we can go in and further adjust the options. You can see the green screen looks good for now, but if you want, you can adjust the color or use the magnifying glass here or pick whip to grab the green color you want. You can change the offset and tolerance to adjust the strength of the green screen key. And you can also adjust the edge thickness and amount of feathering or softness to make your edges look nicer. Once you've adjusted all these settings and are happy, go ahead and click on OK to save, and now we can preview our new green screen look. Part 2. How to use split screen. The split screen or multi-screen effect is an amazing feature that helps you display two or more videos at once on the same screen. To use the split screen effect, first we need to drag in our desired video to the timeline, and once we've brought in our footage to the timeline here, we'll go up to the top and select split screen. And this is going to bring up all of the split screen options we have. These are the various templates we can choose to have different numbers of frames or screens on the screen. So all we have to do is select one of these templates we like, let's say this one, and we'll drag it down on top of our footage. Now if we go ahead and go in and select our split screen effect, we can go into the advanced options to adjust which screens are going to be visible here. So you can see it has three default layers on our timeline, which will represent our three different split screens. So what we can do is just click on one of the videos and then the plus button of the video we want to replace it with, and this will create our split screen effect with any of our layers. And of course, once you're happy with your effects or your split screen, just click on OK to save these changes and it will be updated inside of the timeline. And once complete, you can simply click on the export button to select a format and video options to export your new split screen and or green screen video to. If you're interested in this video editor, you can download it easily from the website. For more editing tips, please search iSkySoft on Google.